How's it going? Hey, it is so rainy in my game today. What the heck? I might just time travel to get out of this rain because you know I don't like it. <laughs> Why are there so many room rooms in the chat? Why are we cars today? Is this what we decided? As a community, as a group. <laughs> also, let me know if the game volume is too loud. Uh, I had some technical issues, so that kind of got messed up a little bit but how's everybody hey hey girl what's up earrings check they are stars little holographic stars they're nice i like them <laughs> hey bestie happy monday using the yard yes <laughs> let's go we decided as a community that we are cars now sounds sounds great sounds fantastic honestly as we have pointed out before we can be cars and we can be geese because both of them honk and it's great <laughs> choose a character everyone i want to be a car yep 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 <laughs> too loud i'll turn it down a little bit it feels loud in my ears you yeah, know i'm a car slash goose it's great it's great where did i get this top i have no idea I truly I, I I have no clue. Uh <laughs> where are you from? I don't know. I would have to look at the tag. That's like impossible right now. Uh yeah, I'm gonna get out of this rain. I'm already feeling feeling sad. Feeling sad. Does that mean we can also be clowns? We're all already clowns. I'm just saying. <laughs> yes, we can be, we can. Lazy, thank you so much for the four months. Four months feels like it's been longer. Thank you for supplying me with the content that inspired my aesthetic. Room, room. Absolutely, absolutely. So glad to be an inspiration. Honestly, I am. I am, I am. All right, give me some, give me some sunshine, please. <laughs> and Savvy Rose, thank you so much for the super chat. Holly, you low-key love the rain on AC. It's like good. Okay, I, I do appreciate it sometimes. You know, there's a, there's a time and place. It's a vibe sometimes, but like specifically today, I want to finish up this build and I want to see it with like the blue sky. So I just, I need the blue. I need the blue today. <laughs> I do. And Bubba Flubber, thank you so much for the super chat. My daughter Lucy loves your videos. Thanks so much for all the great content. Thank you. And thank you, Lucy. I appreciate it so much. I'm so glad to be here doing stuff. Ah, yes. I'll take some sunshine. Thank you. <laughs> 
Raven wants sunshine. Meanwhile, I live in the Arctic tundra. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm feeling hog. <laughs> That's a mood. <laughs> uh, Mochi Babe, thank you so much for the super chat. Hey, Froggy, what's your birthday villager? Mine is Tangy. Oh, that's like the best one. That's like the best one. Anybody who has uh, Tangy and Lily, I'm so jealous of you. Mine is Tybalt, Tybalt, however you say it. And there's another one that I always forget. Uh, Animal Crossing, August 19th, villager birthday. I have two. Alice. Alice and Tybalt, Tybalt, whatever. They're all right. They're all right, you know. Mess with the honk, you get the bonk. I love it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Looking forward to dinner today. Woo, what's the craving for me? What is the craving for me? What is the craving? Do We need to ask ourselves more. What is the craving? <laughs> Today's craving. It's a good one. It's a good one. Where is it? Why is it tiny at the top? Hello? Get Be big. Be large. Today... <sighs> Today's craving is Costco pizza. <laughs> It's Costco pizza. Wait, does that mean it's gonna be big when I go back to the game? Don't be large. Oh, now it's just gone. Oh, there we go. Okay, it's fine. Costco pizza. <laughs> or just pizza in general. Honestly. E either one. Either one. I'm not that picky when it comes to pizza. <laughs> the Costco churros are where it's at. Did you hear they're getting rid of them? Did you hear they're getting rid of them and replacing them with just a giant cookie? I can get a cookie anywhere. I There's so few places I can get a churro. And Costco is taking that away from me. I don't even have a Costco membership and I'm mad. <laughs> uh, uh, Megan Crossing, thank you so much for the super chat. Hey from Scotland, love you so much. Can you say, hey Megan, hey Megan. Thank you so much. And Nathan, thank you for the super chat. It's your birthday today. Oh my goodness, happy birthday. I hope you have a fantastic one. And you know what? I hope you get a Costco churro. In some way. In some way. Yeah, I don't know. I I could be wrong. I could be misinformed. I did hear it from TikTok, so you know, take that with a grain of salt, but it's it's happening, allegedly. Allegedly. The guy with the Grammarly dad is back. Welcome back. So glad to have you back. <laughs> this is your rise to fame. <laughs> This is your rise to fame. <laughs> Amanda, thank you so much for the super chat. You're the reason I changed my island to Kid Gore slash plant life and my aesthetic. Oh my goodness, yay. I hope you've been having so, so much fun with that. It's so great. It's so fun, isn't it? <laughs> and Margie, thank you so much for gifting a Froggy Crossing membership. I appreciate that so much. I do, I do. And I, I didn't see who got it. But congrats. Congrats. Um new member and welcome to the clubhouse and there's there's costco pizza in there there's costco pizza even though we don't have a, a membership how does that work i don't know i don't know oh but speaking of churros okay sorry this is my last chatting before i get into the into the stream today did you see that subway has foot long churros and foot long cookies unless i'm also being gaslit about that subway foot long let me just make sure I wasn't being trolled. Okay, no. Subway Newsroom has a press release about it. It's legit. It's legit. They have a footlong churro, pretzel, and cookie. Let me pull up a, a picture so we can all um, bask in this glory together. And so anyone who doesn't have a Subway can be jealous, honestly. <laughs> oh my god, a snipping tool! On my new computer, it has Windows 11, or Windows whatever, the new Windows, and it's just interesting sometimes. Okay, let me pull up this picture, and then we'll find- we'll actually get into stream, I promise. I'm just- I'm just chatty in the beginning. Where is my screenshot? Where is my screenshot? I'm gluten-free! No! I'm sorry! <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh my goodness. Okay, this picture doesn't want to save. They're called Subway Sidekicks. 
Doesn't that just look stunning and delicious? <laughs> no, the gluten-free. <laughs> like on, okay, okay. If these are all the same price, the cookie is the best deal because look at how much more cookie you get. Look at the thickness. Look at the thickness. <laughs> the churro looks so sad. A foot long churro is just a regular churro. This is what you could have gotten at Costco. The pretzel looks sad, I'll be honest. The pretzel looks a little sad. Why are there like five pieces of salt on it? You know what I mean? The footlong cookie, I do actually want to try that. I'm crying. Is it only one singular churro? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> okay, no, there's different prices. The churro is $2. The pretzel is $3. The cookie is five whole dollars. All right. All right. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. My next stream, I go and get these and we just do a, a taste test stream. <laughs> As a Subway employee, the churro is fire. The pretzel is pretty good. The cookie's awful. Just get a regular, regular cookie. No, my hopes and dreams. My hopes and dreams are dashed. <laughs> Can't have any of them dairy allergy. I'm so sorry. No. All right. Well, anyways, the pretzel looks disturbing. <laughs> It looks like a bug. I can see that. I can see that. Oh, okay. Anyways, let's let's get into it. M, thank you so much for the super chat. Do you recommend a theme for my new island? Hey, it's it's uh cold in most places right now, so why not do something sunny? Do Tropicor with me for your next island for the little price, twenty nine ninety nine. That's a a subscription to I don't know what it is. <laughs> Tropicore if you're interested. I, I've been having a lot of fun doing it. You always say you're gonna do this stream but you never do. <laughs> oh my goodness. I, I just like to chat okay. Never had Costco food? I like it. It's it's like not incredible but it's good for what it is. Which is uh what are those places called again? Um membership warehouse store uh what's it called what's the name of it not courtroom food food room food court food court food that's what i was trying to remember <laughs> anyways all right besties if you weren't here last week this is what we were working on it was looking so good it is looking so good still looking fantastic i just didn't finish all of it because uh surprise surprise i couldn't finish it in my two hours so that's what we're gonna do today we're gonna work on finishing this up and then i'm gonna see if i can get a thought bubble and potentially potentially go on a villager hunt again get that started so that's what we're gonna be doing so i'll give you a little tour around here we've got our little path it's uh it's real cute we got karopi snack we've got flamingos we've got so many trees probably too many it's a little excessive but that's kind of the vibe i was going for so adorable so yeah we'll just finish this up have a good time and then we'll get to the spicy stuff the villager hunting <laughs> the bubble i actually did see one on sally the other day but i was gonna do this build so i was like let me not kick her out hopefully hopefully she gets it again you know what i mean the legendary karopi snack yes sprout thank you so much for the super chat and mochi babe thank you for the super chat i was watching your leapfrog playthrough and i auto filled stitches and petrie was just about to go hunting for him it was crazy your luck your luck is incredible oh my goodness congratulations oh yes and if you were not here last week i i have news i now have a frog rock design frock it is actually the best thing on this island right now so it's it's truly completing what needs to be completing what needs to be completed on this island i messed that up you get the gist i didn't have a stone custom design for way too long so i needed to find one and i found that and i was like done done the second i saw that it was the one it was the one i'll hail the frock yes <laughs> frock is the new rock <laughs> i'm doing a christmas core island that sounds so fun I have not done a Christmas island or festive uh, island like that yet, so that's definitely on my bucket list. But the main thing we needed to get done, which I didn't really do yesterday, was put more trees down on this right side because I ran out of trees and I didn't feel like getting more or whatever, time traveling, planting more. So I got more trees, 
got more trees, so now we can now we can proceed. <laughs> we can pick a one. They they have also been bullying me. They don't let me place them where I know they can be placed. See? See? I knew they could put one there. They just wanted to I don't know. Bully me, I guess. Just scream so loudly my cat was scared. Oh no! Hope it's hope everything's okay. I wish there was a villager named Bubble. That would be so cute, actually. What is your main hobby of life? Frock. <laughs> yeah. Alice is shiny. Thank you so much for the super chat. I had a really crummy day today, so I'm glad you're streaming. Also wanted to tell you my cat's middle name is Crunchwrap Supreme. That is fantastic. Honestly, best cat middle name ever. I'm so sorry you had a crummy day. I hope that it gets so much better, and I hope that we can give you a little bit of, of silliness and, and joy here in this stream today. But thank you so much for spending time with us. Thank you. My cat's name is Bubbles. Yes. I love it. Welcome, Sarah. No worries. Oh, nice. That just took both of the trees. Okay, great. Why are there so many... F uh, I was going to call them frogs. Oh my goodness. Why are there so many alligator butts over here? What's going on? <laughs> Too many. We, we, we will leave the frog right there. That's That's fine. That's fine. I had a crunch wrap the other day with a spicy sauce, of course. Best decision of my life. Oof, sounds so good. Uh, my boyfriend loves getting crunch wraps now with steak. So good. Oh, can we talk about Taco Bell prices for a second? This is gonna be another food rant. Me, Quack, and my friend Mary went to Taco Bell the other day and the three of us got dinner at Taco Bell. It was $50. Fifty dollars. Fifty. Do Why was it fifty dollars? <laughs> Why was it fifty dollars? Okay, Mary got three Doritos tacos. Quack also got three Doritos tacos, and I think a Crunch Wrap, but like with the six steak stu subbed. And I got stuff off the value menu. We got I got three things from the value menu. Why was it fifty dollars? <laughs> what is happening? I have no idea what's happening. This is ridiculous. So in summary, um, I don't know. Talk about lower your prices. <laughs> it's so expensive now, for real. <laughs> what do you recommend from Taco Bell? Um, I, I always get Doritos Locos Tacos. I think they're so good. And... They have a new nacho, uh, like nacho plate thing on the dollar menu. Well, it's not dollar anymore. It's three dollars or whatever. But it comes with guacamole, which is usually like extra everywhere. So it's pretty good. It's smaller than the, the normal ones, though. Claire, thank you so much for the super chat. Hey, Raven, my best friend went back to college. Before he left, I got to meet two of his college friends and it went really well. Bubble vibes. <laughs> Thanks for the bubble vibes. But I'm so glad that went well. Oh my goodness. I'm, I'm so happy for you. Um, I'm sure that you'll be missing your friend, but I'm sure, hopefully, that you guys will be able to, you know, see each other, keep in contact, all that kind of good stuff. Five layer beef burrito, Dorito taco, fiesta potato, two cups of nacho cheese. Two cups of nacho cheese? What are we doing with the cheese? Are we spreading? Are we dipping? I'm I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. <laughs> and Lacey, thank you so much for the super chat. Frock the Rock Johnson. <laughs> oh my god. I love it. I, I love it. <laughs> thank you. Uh hmm. Do I want this tree here? I kinda wanna move this over by one spot, because we're kinda covering the a stone head there. I've got some cherries. <laughs> rock the rock. Like, Taco Bell used to be like, okay, it's not good, but it's super cheap, you know? And sometimes it hits. Sometimes it is delicious. But now it's just not even that good and expensive. So what's going on? I hear the, um... The, the true way to order from Taco Bell is using the app. I use the app, but not as much as I should. Apparently things are cheaper if you do do it on the app, so I need to I need to get on that more. I forgot to use the app for the $50 order, because we were just going through the drive-thru, you know? 
We didn't know what we wanted. We wanted to go through the drive-thru. But yeah, that's my- those are my Taco Bell woes. Thanks for listening. <laughs> and, uh, Phoenix, thank you so much for the super chat. Hey, Froggy, when are you doing a Goose Time today? Love you so much. Thanks for asking. Goose Time- Goose Time just happens naturally, you know? Goose Time just happens naturally. I think for sure we should do a Goose Time once I finally finish this. Like, definitely. Um, aside from that, it just- it just comes to us. You know, it just comes to us. <laughs> Cursed craving is frock. Please don't eat frock. Please don't eat him. Alright, I managed to put a decent amount of trees on the right side, so let's take a look. Um, I just want to be sure here. Let me take off my face cam for just a sec. So you guys can see. As we're walking up, I want to see nothing but trees on both sides here. Okay, you see that top right corner? Yeah. Yeah, up there? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we need more trees over there. That's looking a little empty. <laughs> but other than that, looking good. Oh no, that's too large. Sorry. Too large too large on your screen. <laughs> Alright, just a couple more there though. Why'd I do that? Why'd I do that? Nope, that's the wrong one. A good cat name is Costco? Ooh, yes. Desperately craving a Reese's Sonic Blast? What? What is that? How? Oh, I'm- Okay, no, I was- I immediately went to, like, slushy, and I was like, How are you doing peanut butter and slushy? But, okay, no, it's probably, like, a milkshake, right? Please- Please say yes. Please say yes. <laughs> uh, Briar, thank you so much for the super chat. I'm late. What did I miss? Not too much, really. Not too much. Um, I've just been placing trees. That's literally it. That's literally it. It's like a McFlurry. Okay, yes, that makes sense. I don't know why my mind immediately went like slushy and I was like, that's questionable. How are you doing peanut butter in slushy drink, you know? But ignore me. Ignore me. <laughs> we'll do, yeah, we'll do another one here. <laughs> McFlurry. Love it. <laughs> Sprout, thank you so much for the super chat. I love Animal Crossing. Do you have any tips? I'm supposed to do my homework, but I'm watching you instead. Oh no, I hope you still finish your homework. That's important. Um, any tips for Animal Crossing? Let's see. I definitely think um, for custom designs, if you have Nintendo Online, they make the world of a difference. They add so much to your island, so don't be afraid to like get rid of ones you don't like anymore and get new ones. Keep searching for like new and cute ones that people are making. Pinterest is great. Um, you could always just literally go on Google and, and, and look for them. They make such a difference. So definitely get as many as you can, you know, like f fill her up, fill up your custom design slots. Mine is almost filled up. Look at this. Well, it is filled up, but some of these are old ones from Leapfrog that I'm going to get rid of. Um, yeah, just have a, have a bunch that you can use because they are so good for adding little detail to your island. They really are. Is Frock a good name for a cat? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and Holly, thank you so much for the one month. Hey, Raven, happy one month already. Will you be doing a Squishmallow video soon? I've just started my collection. Oh my goodness. Nice. Uh, I don't know. I, I'm, I don't have any plans for my next one yet, so it's all up in the air right now but hopefully soon and rainbow fairy lights thank you so much for the super chat hot dog juice and merry chops or reset your island <sighs> hot dog juice and merry chops or reset your island you know i'm gonna have to go with reset honestly because i don't think i can handle hot dog juice and chops i can handle one of them on their own but not both together you know what i mean both together is like way too powerful and I don't think I would survive. I don't think I would live. So I have to go reset. <laughs> and Blueberry Crossing, thank you for the super chat. Can you play more Super Animal Super Animal Royale vids? Oh my goodness, yes, we definitely have to play more. Me and Quack were so obsessed with playing that so much, so we definitely we gotta do more. They have so many new like um animals that are in the game now too that I gotta get. And they're so cute. 
Hot dog juice in a wine glass for a toast after marrying chops. No! <laughs> no. No. Too that's that's too much. That's too much. I can't I can't handle that. I, I cannot. I'd I'd rather reset. I'd rather reset. I really would. <laughs> when are you gonna play Roblox? I've been trying to think of what the next video I want to do for Roblox is. I don't know if I should keep trying the games I've already been playing or if I should try a new one. I don't know. And Sophie, thank you so much for the four months. I understand the pain of setting up a PC. I was literally doing it like an hour ago because my mom got a new PC. Yeah, right? It's it's just kind of annoying, you know? Like, it's not that hard, but it's just like kind of annoying. <laughs> so I'm glad you understand. I'm glad. Okay, I'm gonna go in with some more bushes. And also, I don't know why this random piece of cliff is right here. We're gonna get rid of that. Roblox voice chat. I am actually terrified of that. I am tr I am actually terrified of doing that. <laughs> My brother will like do that stuff sometimes and I'm just too scared. Terrified. I don't know what goes on there. I don't really want to find out. I I really was liking Hello Kitty Cafe, so my first instinct is to go back to Hello Kitty Cafe. Okay, that's looking cute. Where can we fit more bushes? This area in the back here looks a little empty. Let's put a bush somewhere. No. To the right? Yeah. Can we have a sleepover? Sure. <laughs> Spooky, scary six-year-olds on Roblox voice chat. I just don't know what people are gonna say, okay? I don't even know if they would say stuff that, like, I can't even put on YouTube, you know? Like, how much is that stuff monitored? I don't know. And I don't really want to find out. <laughs> I think I'm good just not knowing, you know? I'm, I'm fine with that. Totally fine with that. Uh, okay, this little section here definitely needs some bushes. This is severely lacking in, uh, in some bush decor. Can I not do it more forward? I can't. S step forward, girl. That's not what- I want to do it- No, I want to do it in the space next to that one. Oh my goodness. I'm actually going to throw my controllers. That's where I wanted to put it. I don't know why that was so hard. Anyways, okay. Thank you, thank you, Bush, for letting me put you down five years later. Uh, maybe one on the very edge. Somewhere here. See, the thing with all these trees is I just can't navigate anywhere. I played Lethal Company with some Gen Alpha kids and oh boy, it was toxic. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. I do like Lethal Company. Just playing some of that. But yeah, I can't imagine playing it with uh, random people. <laughs> this is really random, but I have an obsession with rubber ducks. I got $20 for my report card and spent it all on ducks. I ordered some on Amazon and they're supposed to come on Friday. Oh, that's so exciting. Uh, oh my goodness. I'm glad that you were able to spend your report card money on something that you really love. And rubber ducks are so cute. So you know what? That was a great choice. I'd, I'd collect rubber ducks. I would. Oh, I've seen some at Five Below. Or I saw a TikTok of some at Five Below that are like dressed up as like different characters. They're really cute. <laughs> okay. Maybe that's good for bushes. Let's get some like other random plants and stuff. I was doing this last week and we'll just like sprinkle them in, you know? And Serena, thank you so much for the super chat. You should kick out Jeremiah and maybe you'll find Lily. Honestly, I've been thinking about that. Like, maybe I just need to get him out of here. I don't know how it works with, like, the probability of finding, like, the certain species when you have them already on your island. But, like, maybe uh, Lily will be more inclined to come here if she knows that she's the only frog around. You know what I mean? <laughs> Do you say you're a millennial or a Gen Z? I'm 23 and I like to say whatever works in my favor. <laughs> I I say Gen Z. I think I'm on the cusp, right? 
1999 i don't know i say gen z i don't identify with millennial i don't and if you think i do just you know what maybe just don't say it <laughs> maybe just maybe just keep that information to yourself you know <laughs> my little cousin has a duck super duck sounds amazing honestly sounds amazing okay uh we'll grab some of these lamps i'm probably gonna need more wheat fields honestly that'll be good i got like littler things butterflies these little plants oh we should definitely do a leaf pile we need moss absolutely moss maybe a shell lamp somewhere Yeah, I'll grab all of that for now. Oh, wait, I saw one more cacao tree. <laughs> What's wrong with millennials? Love an older millennial. Oh, nothing at all. Nothing at all. In my brain, I'm like, oh, if people think that I'm a millennial, then people think that I'm older than I am, or it signifies that I am getting older. And I just don't want to have a crisis about that. I'm turning 25 this year and I'm actually not going to think about it until the day of my actual birthday. <laughs> it's just me coming to terms with that kind of stuff, you know? It's, it's, it's a me problem. It's a me problem. <laughs> and Miss Honey, thank you for the 27 months. Do a poll for what generation everyone here is. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I, I definitely would, but uh, I, I don't want to go too deep in that territory of revealing personal information on the internet, you know? Turning 25 is scary. I don't like it. I know. <laughs> if it helps, 30s are great. That does help. That, that does help. You know, I'm sure it's going to be absolutely fine. It's just, you know that, you know that thing where in your head you're still like 17? I'm still coming to terms with I'm not 17 anymore. <laughs> Which I think, in, a, in a, a real conversation, is I think uh, COVID definitely affected that because it was like many years that were just weird time-wise, you know what I mean? So, I feel like a lot of people just, uh, I don't know, feel like time passed differently, you know? It's, it's deep stuff, deep stuff. <laughs> 25 and scared of turning 26 means mostly because I don't want to get care from my parents insurance. I need my meds. That's totally valid. That's totally valid. I'm definitely still a 32 year old teenager. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I accidentally picked up that stone head, but you know what? While we're here, we might as well put some sand and ruin the rest of our stuff. That's great. That's great. <laughs> I love the Costco pizza is amazing. It is. You have to kick out Tangy so Lily sees that you kicked out your favorite villager for her? Oh my goodness. She's supposed to stay on this island though, I don't know about that. Then we have to do the, the hunt for Tangy again. <laughs> I'm 24 going on 86, so I don't know what you youngsters are talking about. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> oh, I love that. I, I am trying to to just mentally, you know, be like, it's fine. Everything's chill. Nothing bad with getting older. It's just hard, especially when, like, all of TikTok is, like, maybe I should get off TikTok, you know? Uh, but all of TikTok is, like, you need retinol for your wrinkles and start using it early while you- so you don't have wrinkles and also don't drink through a straw so you don't get face lines and um, you should tape down your wrinkles while you sleep, blah 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 and I'm like <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that's just what the feeling that I get. Um, which I don't do any of that stuff, but it's like when that's all you're hearing, it's like hmm. sometimes some of it like earworms itself into your brain. Which I'm trying not to let worm into my brain. <laughs> the most terrifying thing is for a ten year old, oh my goodness. You know, if they're if they're getting started on a skincare routine, that's great. I think, you know, just a simple wash your face, moisturize is, is always good. No way, wrinkles just show, show experience. No wrinkles mean you didn't show emotion. <laughs> yeah, I, I think there's there's nothing wrong with them. There's nothing wrong with them. What small item do I want over here? Do we do another lamp on the frock? 
I think that's good. Let's do the butterfly over here. And some sunscreen. Yes, sun sunscreen is definitely important. Gotta protect that skin. Would you rather reset Pelican Bay or Leapfrog? Oof. Technically, I did reset Pelican Bay. So I guess Pelican Bay again. <laughs> uh, let's see. I think I want to do a... Where's the little potted plant thing? I think that'll be cute here. There you are. Excuse me. Excuse me. Can I pull this over? Thank you. <laughs> you need drunk elephant. Drunk elephant was already popular before all of this too. It's just so funny. It's supposed to be good stuff. Isn't it just expensive? I think I looked into it for something. Maybe moisturizer? I was like, dang, this is a lot. <laughs> Thank you, Selena. I appreciate it. I, I really am enjoying this this build a lot. I wanted like some pure like tropical energy somewhere on the island. Because, you know, the island is Florida themed. But even though the island is Florida themed, we're having builds that are around here that are like Miami. Everglades, and it's like different from like pure tropical. So we needed pure tropical en energies somewhere, somewhere. It's mostly about the children going into the shop and ruining all the testers. Oh, oh, are they making drunk elephant smoothies? I didn't know that was part of it actually. <laughs> Not the smoothies. <laughs> You know what? Speaking of drunk elephant, why don't we go ahead and do a froggy crossing hydration check. If you have your drunk elephant skincare around you, um, you can drink it as hydration inside and out. What, what do you think about that? <laughs> if you haven't been here before, you're going to grab your beverage, um, hopefully some water. Drunk elephant's fine too, I guess. We're going to wait for that timer to hit 30 seconds and once it does, we're all going to take a sip together, okay? It's great. Delicious. Great way to moisturize yourself from the inside. It's fantastic. Are you ready? Take a sip. I have no drink because I'm in bed. Oh no, that's okay. <laughs> Great job, everybody. Ivy, thank you so much for the super chat. Silent Watcher, I really enjoy your cozy content. Thank you so much, Ivy. I am I am so appreciative of you being a silent watcher and and uh sending me a little message. I appreciate that. Thank you. Slay the Stanley. <laughs> uh, I want to clarify, I got the Stanley a while ago, before the Stanley drama, okay? I, and I have one singular Stanley. That makes a difference at all. Although I, I do think that the like Valentine's Day ones that they released, I did think they were cute. And if they were um, reasonably distributed and I saw one in the wild, I might have bought it. Full transparency. <laughs> Because it was cute. Ooh, does soap count? Mm, no. Sorry. <laughs> soap does not count, unfortunately. Today it doesn't count. Maybe tomorrow. I am and for all I always am and forever a hydro flask girly. Whatever works for you, honestly. Work. <laughs> work as in W-E-R-K work whatever works for you the important thing is that something helps you drink water and that's what the stanley does for me not sponsored <laughs> uh okay let's put a wheat field back here even though i am low on them i'm gonna need them for a different area but we will sacrifice we will sacrifice i have an engraved yeti that's so cool actually my mom bedazzled her Stanley and went to work with the cat and came back with seven Stanleys because her friends wanted bedazzled Stanleys. Can, can she bedazzle mine? Oh my goodness. The cursed craving is that delicious drunk elephant smoothie. Ooh, yeah. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> and then imagine it's actually sponsored. You know, I, I, would, I would take it. I don't think they need me to sponsor. They don't need to sponsor me. They have so much publicity right now. For free, kind of. <laughs> uh, can we fit this big thing back here? No. We'll, we'll put a flamingo. I feel like we haven't had flamingo here in a second. 
Yeah, that's that's good. That's cute. It's kind of kind of hidden, you know. But you see it as you walk up from this way. I'm gonna be drinking my Hello Kitty perfume. No, no, <laughs> not the Hello Kitty perfume. What else do I want to put? I don't know. I'm running out of ideas. I'm trying to put the small stuff. Oh, shell lamp. Yes. Cute. It almost looks green when it's lit. Right? Doesn't that look green? I'm gonna turn it off. I don't like it. <laughs> Too green. Get your Stanley today in Target now. Fine print. Please be aware that you may have to camp out to get one and fight other people. Just how it goes, though. <laughs> uh, you know what? Maybe can we fit some bamboo partitions? Maybe just one back here. Wheat field. Bamboo grass. Here's a partition. Ooh, yes. Hey, what's up, you guys? Yes. Okay, and then we put the shell lamp. Perfect. What if we put our drunk elephant smoothies into our Stanley Cups, guys? Mmm. <laughs> it is green, by the way, and the green is kind of cute. It is. I just want a little pop of yellow, you know? Because we've got a lot of green here. We've got a lot of green. This spot needs something. Glowing moss. Just came to me. Yes. Yes! Oh, this is looking so good. I'm so excited about this. Okay, what else can we do? Mmm, tastes like trends gone wrong. <laughs> oh, goodness. I kind of want almost another bush here. I like that. Trunk elephants, I missed something. It's a skincare brand that is going viral right now, as the kids say. Um because people are going into Sephora and using the testers and like combining them to like make smoothies. I don't know. I, I don't really, I, I, don't, I don't understand. <laughs> what do you do with the smoothie? What do you do with the smoothie? Where does it go? What happens to it? We gotta ask these questions, guys. We gotta ask these questions. All right, this little edge over here definitely needs some custom designs. Hey guys, today I have a drunk elephant bronzing drop smoothie. It tastes like money going down the drain. <laughs> oh my goodness. Mmm, delicious. You drink it, obviously, put it on your face, but it's from testers. I don't know why specifically Drunk Elephant skincare. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe because the packaging is, is preppy? I don't know. Don't ask me. I'm not the one making the smoothies. You know, I would smoothies would be fine. Just buy the products and take them home and do it. Don't do it in the store. <laughs> Grandma McNugget, thank you so much for the super chat. And Briar, thank you so much for the super chat. Slams money on table. Where did you find the shell lamp now? <laughs> <laughs> um, it's a DIY. It's a DIY. Where do you get the shell stuff? I think it's, it's one of the ones that can just wash up on the beach. I'm pretty sure, right? Leave it there and don't clean it up. No. What is Drunk Elephant? Is it a Florida thing? <laughs> no, it's a skincare brand that's like really popular right now with like kids. I don't know why it's called Drunk Elephant. I don't know. I don't- listen, I'm just relaying the trends, okay? I'm just relaying the trend, I don't know. <laughs> Go ask the person who made the skincare brands. They'll know more than me. It's either Pascal or on the beach. Does Pascal give you the shell furniture? I thought it was only the mermaid furniture. We need to include a froggy chair somewhere. You know, you're kind of right. You're kind of- on to something right now, honestly. Let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. I'm trying to fill in these last couple of gaps. Um, festival lamp. Bamboo grass. Ooh, a little bamboo grass here would be cute. 
just sticking out. I thought the shell stuff was in the summer. It could be in the summer. I just know that, uh, it's, it's DIYs. Make it from shells. As far as I know. I've, everyone in my high school uses it, but I don't understand what's so good about it. It's expensive. I don't know. I, cu I couldn't tell you. That's all I knew about it too, that it was expensive. <laughs> That's all I knew. I think it has like cute, uh, I think it has cute packaging, so maybe that's why people like it. Like I said, very preppy. We need another frock over here. Definitely. Mm, beautiful. And then, and then... Glowing moss. Yep. What do you want? What do you want? C keep walking. Keep walking. Mm -hmm. Walk off my screen. Thank you. Thank you. I tried two of their products and broke out. Oh no, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That's very unfortunate. Okay, uh, I have a few things that can go here kind of like on the side to fill in these little gaps. And by a few, I think I mean literally two, but that's okay. <laughs> and that you literally can't even see because of the telephone pole or the whatever pole thing city thing you know what I mean uh, let's do our second one over here pull it over a little bit fill in that little gap ooh yes <laughs> froggy chair soup good soup ooh yummy okay yeah let's see where we can put a froggy chair I think I think we have to right I think we have to I ever heard of Planet Zoo? I feel like I have, but I don't really know. Is it a game? Uh, let's do type, yeah. And go to chairs. Green froggy chair, obviously. Where's a good spot? Hmm. I wish I could Just let me put it here. Glitch the game. Just let me put it here. Please. Please let me put a froggy chair here. Wouldn't it be so good under this? Wouldn't it be so fantastic? Oh, it'd be so good. Um, I'm tempted to put it like somewhere where you could sit and like take a cute picture, but I don't know where that'd be. Maybe just directly on top of the frock. Potentially? What's the picture look like if we do it over here? Honestly, pretty cute. I like that. And if we zoom out, I'll put some more stuff on the beach. Frog on frog. Frog on frog, yeah. Absolutely. I think that's the spot. That's the spot. Sounds great. <laughs> Sounds fantastic. Uh, let me grab some more few items, I suppose. If I even have anything. Oh, you know what? There's a severe lack of flowers. We gotta do this. We gotta, we gotta put more flowers. Sour Duck, thank you so much for the super chat. Hi, Froggy. I got a crochet kit to make my first plushie. Are you working on any crochet projects? Also, I should have said Drunk Elephant Smoothie right now. <laughs> should I have said Drunk Elephant Smoothie right now? Oh my goodness. Oh, always. Always. We're we're all making Drunk Elephant Smoothies every day now. It's the new it's the new law, actually. Um, but that's so exciting. Crochets, cr crochet kits are so fun. I do have a project I'm working on. Hold on, let me grab it. So, I showed this in my last vlog. I'm gonna do a video making outfits for my Build-A-Bears. So, I'm working on the template slash pattern for that, right? This is not the final product, okay? It's a very bright color. Wait, let, let me put on the skirt. Hold on. Um, so, I'm just figuring out... I'm just using whatever leftover yarn that I want to use up for this. Eh. But, I made the, the sweater. And then yesterday, I was working on a skirt. It's almost done. To make like a little sweater skirt for my Build-A-Bear. Look at that. I, the color is not my favorite. I'll be honest. Not my favorite color, but look at her. Mini skirt and 
crop sweater? She's living the life. She's living the dream. Cute, right? <laughs> so again, orange does not reflect the final color it's going to be. And I'm going to add some details and stuff, but working on that. That's what I've been working on. <laughs> Isn't it cute, right? I think it's coming out really good. It's coming out so good. Uh, Lacey, thank you so much for the super chat. I just decided I'm going to make a cheap skincare brand called Poor People for Us Poor People. <laughs> poor People for Us Poor People. You're, honestly, you're kind of onto something. <laughs> I, I love that. I love that. <laughs> Can I please glue? Glue what? Name for her? I don't know. I'm so bad at naming my plushies. I don't know. Spork. We're gonna go with Spork. It's a good name, right? I just, I just need to think of something random and just go with it. First thing that pops into my head, just gotta commit, you know? Just gotta commit. These flowers, can I, can I say these flowers are actually getting out of hand? <laughs> this did not start like this. This is getting actually really bad. I'll have to fix that eventually. Or a competitor skincare brand called Sober Mouse. Let's go. What? Don't bully me about Spork. What do you mean? <laughs> Don't put spork question mark question mark. <laughs> Let me name my build a bear frog spork. I'm sorry, okay? That was the first thing I thought of. Would you rather her have no name? Would you rather her be nameless? No. At least she has a name. Spork is a peak name. Thank you. Thank you. Jeez. <laughs> Don't appreciate my genius naming skills around here. <laughs> one of them's gonna be Spork. Another one is, is going to be, um, I don't know, I'll think of it, okay? When it comes to me, it comes to me. Sporky from Toy Story 4. N no, not affiliated with Sporky. Just Spork. I'm just confused on how Spork was the first thing that came to mind. I don't know. I don't know. I, that I can't- that I don't have an answer. Um, I think another one will be Taco Bell Hot Sauce Packet. I think that's a good one. What else? Did I do red on this side? I did. You know what? That's fine. Actually, that's cute. I like the two red mums. That's real cute. I don't know which one's gonna be Taco Bell Hot Sauce Packet. Maybe... Mm, I think the green one actually because they talk about used to have a verde sauce that was so delicious and they got rid of it and I cry every day thinking about it. Spork is goaded. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. <laughs> Sava, thank you so much for the super chat. Raven, why are there a bunch of crocodile patterns on the ground? <laughs> it's Florida. It's Florida. There's crocodiles everywhere, you know? That's that's why, and definitely not because I changed around my custom designs and replaced some of them and it just messed everything up. That's not why. No. No. <laughs> not the Taco Bell chat again. Listen, I am a Taco Bell stan, okay? I'm sorry. <laughs> this right side looks... Nicky. But it's half a crocodile, I know. It's cause, yeah, I was, I was replacing custom designs and they just get messed up. They just get messed up, it's just what happens. Oh, we have one more cacao tree. We'll put that back here. Just fill up some of that empty space. Uh, I almost wanna put more flowers, but that seems a little too much. Of course, we're from Florida. It's normal to see crocodile butts on the ground every day. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> you don't? You don't? Uh, nah, you know, we'll do one more festival lamp just because I, I really like them. A 
my goodness, I've been doing this for almost an hour. That's okay. You know, these fine details, they take time. They take time and they just take a lot of really, really careful planning and not wearing frogs on our on our tops. We'll put a lizard. We'll put a lizard. You can't even see him back there. Kind of. It's fine. Uh, we'll, do the, we'll do the little froggy over here. Most of the time we were talking about frogs. Yeah. Yeah. No, you can't even see the froggy at all. Okay, hold on. Um, you know what? Speaking of alligators. Put that here instead. <laughs> Better be careful walking down this path. Better watch it. They're chill. Honestly, like, as long as you don't bother them, they're fine. I've walked past my fair share of crocodiles. They're, they, they, they kind of chill. You know, they kind of chill. <laughs> Not Raven being a fake Florida woman just called alligators crocodiles. I guess, oh yeah, yeah, which one is this custom design? Yeah, that's probably an alligator, huh? I mean, Florida has both, so I just, I don't know. I use them interchangeably. Let's just say Froggy's a survivor. <laughs> Yay, a full-length alligator. You're welcome. You're welcome. Okay, um, I think final detail I'm gonna work on, and then this will pretty much be done, which will not even actually be fully finished, but it's okay, is putting some more wheat fields here. Because I think it's I think it's nice. Do I like true crime before I go to bed? Um, I do not. It's not my thing. I um I don't I've never liked horror or crime or anything like that. I don't know. It just freaks me out too much. <laughs> it wouldn't be peaceful for me. I know for some people it's peaceful, but for me it's not. Unfortunately. She's been lying to us this whole time. She's not a real Floridian. Get her! <laughs> Lock me up. <laughs> Lock me up. I have a frog build bear named Dapper. I love that. One of my frog build bears is going to be named Costco Pizza, and none of you can stop me from doing that. Just saying. Costco Pizza, Spork. Um, what was the other one? Talk about hot sauce packets. They're, they're up and coming, you know, like in, in the world of Build-A-Bear. If you get a good name as Build-A-Bear, that's like elite status, you know? Okay, I need, I need more of those. Let's just, uh, we'll order some more. Not being a Floridian gives you, gives us less of a reason to lock you up. <laughs> that's true. That's true. Okay, let's get some wheat fields. Ooh, I should name one of them Footlong Churro. That's a really good one. Marina, that's a really good one. <laughs> How about Stanley? Actually, that's really funny. That's really funny. <laughs> and Sarah, thank you so much for the super chat. Hey, Froggy, I'm watching with my friend. Hello. Thank you both for watching. Thank you, thank you. Should I name one waffles? That'd be good. <sighs> Costco pizza. Who? Which one should be Costco pizza? I don't know. Okay, I only have one, two, three, four, five frog build bears, and then I have three other Sanrio build bears. So we gotta be very diligent with which which one gets which name. You know, they have to really reflect who they are as a build bear. You know. Will you have peach and pepper and name one pickle? I could. You know what? I would take it a step further. Not name him just pickle, but pickle jar. Or pickle juice. One of those would be really good. Or pickle jar juice. Oh yeah, the giant one. I completely forgot. Oh. I completely forgot about him. The biggest stuffed animal in my office. 
<laughs> right, because Spork really reflects who they are. It does. Okay, listen. His name is Spork. Okay, one of their names is Spork. They... Hold on, I, I got this. I, there's an analogy in my head. I just have to form a sentence. What What is a spork? It's a combination of a, of a spoon and a fork, right? It's got the round edges of a spoon and the tough, stabby... S -s -s what are they called? Prongs of a fork. Okay? You know, it's, it's kind of like both sides of the equation. Spork the Build-A-Bear is both sides of the equation in the sense that he has a soft side, a caring side, a nurturing side, you know? He feels very deeply, but because he feels so deeply, he lashes out. He's got his tough side. He's got his stabby side. Sometimes he just might be a little, like, snappy, you know? Sometimes he just is too overwhelmed with his emotions because he feels so- he's an empath. He feels so much that he lashes out. He's got things buried deep inside. And that is why the name Spork will reflect him as a Build-A-Bear, okay? We also have a campsite villager, so... Let's go. <laughs> Thinks I hate it. Listen, I... That was genius of me, okay? That was genius of me. Talk about Hot Sauce Packet is not nearly as deep as Spork, personality-wise. Um, it's mostly just one of those things, you know, where your parents are a fan of something and they name you after it and you're like, what? I don't even know what this is. <laughs> okay, our campsite villager, of course. I feel like I have one every single time I stream or record. Never fails. You know who I'm hoping for. You know, let's just, let's just see. It's not going to be her, though. It's not going to be her. I'm trying to reverse psychology. Oh, but it's Zell. So. Okay. I mean, at least it's not someone terrible. That's fine. I'll take that. <laughs> Please play Untitled Goose Game. I've actually played it a couple years ago. It's somewhere on my channel. I played it with Quack. It was very fun. And that's where the, the Goose Song was born from. Speaking of goose song, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna give myself goose time for coming up with that spork analogy. I don't care. I don't care. I deserve it. I'm a duck. Thank you. Thank you. You know. Sorry. I I ha I had to I had to give it to myself. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to put down these last few wheat fields and then we'll get to looking for a thought bubble and see if we can manage to start a hunt today. I think this is a good um what's it called? A good kind of schedule. You know, I I hunt until I'm kind of tired of it, then I autofill and then I just build and then once I do a build and I'm tired of building, I go look for another villager <laughs> and we repeat the cycle. I think it'll work out great, honestly. Mm, let's Oh, I've been placing these. Oh no, that one's not directly in the corner. I'll fix that one day. One day. Love the spork lore. Thank you. Thank you. I worked really hard on it. I took like almost a minute to think of it. Might be a world record. Gonna grab your switch. Nice. Have fun. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> the path though, thank you. I I love it. It's so good. I've been imagining doing this on this island for a while, so I'm very excited that we we finally pulled it off. Uh, I need so many more wheat fields. Do I have none in my storage? I don't think I do. I think I took them all last time, but all right, let's do one final look. I'll get wheat fields later. I I don't feel like doing all of that. The plan is. 
to extend this further back, okay? I'm just not doing it now because it's right behind Nooks and Ables, like on the map if we look. We're literally right behind Nooks and Ables. So I need to move those, but in order to move those, I need to figure out where they're going and what I'm doing with them. I'm not figuring all that out yet. So for now, we have this short path, but it will be longer. And then I'll probably have to put more trees and stuff. But for now, <laughs> this is the general concept of what I wanted to do. We just have like this really cute overlooking path, arch, not archway, bridge, bridge. <laughs> Um, and it's just really cute and you just look out at all of the nature and the flora and the karopi snacks that are in there and the alligators and that's that's all it really is it's just like a little lookout area and it's super adorable and maybe eventually on that cliff that's on the back right I'll put more palm trees and we'll have even more stuff to look at so cute so cute so yeah this is a uh, this is our work. This is what has taken me two streams to do, but I think it was so worth it. It's so adorable. And we really needed, again, that big burst of Tropicore vibes over here. So love it. I'm going to be done for now. Again, it's not fully finished. I need more wheat fields and to fix the cliffs and stuff. But as a general, general concept and build, it's for the most part done. And you can take a little walk. We've got this little gazebo over here cute photo op and we walk down this path and it's so cute and it's the best thing I've ever seen in my life yeah honestly this is my favorite build right now so absolutely love it absolutely love it stupendous job Raven thank you so much frock out of 10 thank you oh my goodness thank you <laughs> thanks so much I appreciate it it took me three hours to do it hey <laughs> I, I am just a little slow like that. This was a lot of tree placement, okay? Which I struggle with, so... I'm just gonna... I'm gonna say... Yeah, that makes sense that it was three hours. Totally. Uh, I'll check really quick if we have any thought bubbles in the plaza. But... I feel like I doubt it. Even though I literally saw one on Sally the other day, like I was saying. That actually looks really good. Thank you. I know it usually doesn't, so thanks. <laughs> okay. Let's start our time traveling. We're gonna go ahead and look for a thought bubble. I uh, am usually pretty bad at getting these, full disclosure. So, it might take us 40 minutes. It might be on this next day that we're going to, but if we get one before stream ends, I'll definitely start the hunt. So stick around if you wanna see me not get Lily. For how many months in a row? Too many. Too many. You know what? Let's just go a while. Yeah. Because when was it? June? Hmm. It's, been like, it's been many months. <laughs> My bestie gotta go eat. I'll see you later, mini cookie. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. <laughs> I was in the bathroom. Who was in the campsite? It was Zell. It was Zell. Someone said traveling 15 to 30 days would normally generate one. I don't care if that works or not. Just saw it. We will, you know, if we don't get one today, I'll literally go like month by month. I can't believe how long this Lily hunt has been going on for. I think the stitches being on your island is a curse. Honestly, right? Honestly. One of the frogs needs to be named hydration check. Oh, absolutely. I think it should be the blue one or the teal one that should be hydration check. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> First stream. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you all for being here. I appreciate it. Um, I was literally streaming on Friday. Also, if you weren't here, I had to move it because I got a new computer. It's a great computer. I had to set it up. But yeah, I usually stream every Monday. If you're new here, come join us. For the most part, it's villager hunts. Um, but I take a break occasionally to do builds or scavenger hunts. I need to get back into doing dream islands. I think I want to do a dream island um, tour or something stream this month. That'd be really fun. Alrighty, let's see. Any nice juicy thought bubbles in the plaza, besties? There's literally no one here. There's literally no one here. Stitches help me 
My island is such a mess too, but like at least these houses for the most part are close to each other. Here's the mail it never fails, it makes me wanna wag my tail. I don't know why we're singing Blue's Clues, but I love it. <laughs> okay, uh, I could go look at every single house. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that. Are any of the Squishmills yet on Whatnot still available? Unfortunately not. They did sell out very quickly. <laughs> but thank you for your interest. I'll definitely have to do that again sometime soon. I'll just start making a bunch of crochet plushies and putting them on there or something. I don't know. <laughs> Leah, thank you so much for the super chat. I'm running on half of a sleep to fire brain cell because I woke up at 3am for no reason. May fall asleep to this, not gonna lie. Honestly, live your best life. Do it. Do it. <laughs> I don't... Did I do this time travel right? I don't know. And Tizra, Tirza, thank you so much for the super chat. Happy to catch a stream. Sending love to Peach Pepper and Spork. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> and Froggy Cats, thank you for the super chat. And Lacey, thank you for the super chat. You need to name a plushie Goose. Yes. Yes. Do I have... I don't think I have Goose plushies. I need to get Goose plushies, honestly. I need to get Goose plushies, but we need to figure out a different one to name Goose. You saying we just got a letter earlier? I sang it because I saw someone saying it in the chat. <laughs> um, but you know, uh, I don't question it too much. It's it's great. It's great. How are Peach and Pepper doing? Good, good. They're doing well. Um, Pepper loves to hold toys in his mouth, especially um, Squishville if he gets his hands on them. And he just, like, cries with it in his mouth, like, in the hallway. Like, he doesn't come to us and, like, show us the toy and cry. Because then if he did that, I would think that he's, like, showing us, like, Hey, look, Mom, I caught this, right? But he just goes in the middle of the hallway and cries with it in his mouth. <laughs> so he was doing that, like, for a while today. So I don't know what was up with that. He's just a silly man. You should crochet a little squishy goose plushie. That'd be so cute, actually. He is a special boy. He is. Okay, I think I did. Did I time travel? Yes, I did. Hello, thought bubbles. Um, who are the ones that I do when I kick out? Ugh. Or Junior. Who's on the beach? Or Junior, Tabby, and Gail. I guess I should check that beach because there are three of them that I want to kick out. Our pet children are weird, yeah. Pepper has a, a software update that he needs to be downloaded, obviously. Obviously, duh. Hold on, let me get my vaulting pole so that I don't have to run around the cliffs every time. Ah, yes, the orange and lineup. Not orange and <laughs> I'm so tired of it. I'm so tired of these orange autofills. Okay, just grab this. Just got a thought bubble of nibbles. Nice. Give me that thought bubble energy, honestly. Give me those thought bubble vibes. I need them. Hello. Thank you. Okay, one. Dead body. Two. Where's the other one? Oh. It's all the way over there. Running through the flowers triggers me. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna be time traveling a lot, so they're gonna regrow. Oh, there's a lot of goodies on this beach, but no thought bubbles. All right, let's go a month. Let's go a month. Rocky Cats, thank you so much for the super chat. Froggy, I forgot to add this to my last message, but how do I get the wheat field decoration? Because I can't find any videos on it. The wheat field's a little tricky. Um, it's in the Nook's Cranny. It's definitely in Nook's Cranny. And I've gotten it before at Red's, actually, at Red's Boat. 
Um, and I think you can get it from Happy Home Paradise. If you have the Wardell shop unlocked, you can order it from there. I don't know if it shows up in actual Happy Home Paradise shop. It must, right? Um, but yeah, unfortunately, it's one of those things where you just have to keep checking all the shops at Red Ship, like, all the time and hope that you get it. But I definitely found it on his ship before. But yeah, sorry, that one's just, like, there's no, like, 100% way to get it. It's just kind of chance. I want pizza so bad. Same. Same. I just heard Quacko Pepper. I wonder what he's doing. How do you get simple panels? That's another thing where it's just like in the shop at some point. So just keep looking. Hi, Rico. No worries. We're literally just starting to look for a thought bubble. So you came at the right time for a thought bubble slash uh, villager hunting. Hopefully soon. Sending thought bubble vibes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Pepper. Da, 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 da mood i want pizza so badly i got not hello fresh but like blue apron because there was a really good deal that they had on it where it was literally only ten dollars like ten dollars and no shipping for two meals with two servings each so i was like oh that's great because obviously i can go for one meal at taco bell for one serving and it's fifty dollars so i'll take ten dollars for two dinners for both me and quack so i did that and i have that to make tonight but i'm like i want pizza so bad <laughs> who is calling me harvey oh i was like what I already did Harv's Island. I already did um, the DLC. What is this? Okay, Gale, no bubble. I don't think there's bubbles on KK days. Uh, we'll go check the beach houses just to be sure. Hello? No. Hello? No. Okay, honestly, just go the next day. Goodbye. I'm not really interested in doing the wedding thing either. <laughs> Literally, I'm the worst about getting groceries for specific dinners than going out to eat anyway. Same. I'll literally go get groceries and then that same night we just like order something. <laughs> It's so bad. And then, like, my credit card always sends me, like, email notifications of, like, your biggest spending category this month was food and drink. And I'm like, cool. Thanks for telling me that. I know. I'm, I'm well aware. You don't, ha you don't have to tell me. I, I know. <laughs> it's so bad. Should I ask my uh, papa to take me to the Dollar General so I can get some things? Yeah, definitely. If you need to get some stuff. Oh, holy Thought Bubble. Where are you, Thought Bubble? We're waiting. We're waiting. We're looking. It'll come. It'll come. In due time. In due time. Who do you want to kick out? Anyone? Anyone? Or Junior, like, I actually wouldn't mind if he stays on the island. But if he has a Thought Bubble, he's going. <laughs> Have you heard or watched Murder Drones? I have not. I have not. We are DoorDash fiends and I still haven't gotten Dash Pass because I believe we will stop. That's such a mood. That's such a mood. Quack has the Uber Eats premium, whatever it is. I, d I just went to another KK day. Oh my goodness. Sometimes I'll get a frozen pizza during grocery run so I don't have to cook. Honestly, I, I need to do that. Hello, where am I right now? Okay. I I need to do that. And I get frozen pizza sometimes. Just for like, yeah. Those days where you're like, I don't want to do anything. But sometimes I just... just sometimes we just order stuff anyway. <laughs> Going to Girl Scouts in your merch? 
Have fun. Thank you for the support. I justify ordering food by being like, well, I pay for Dash Pass, so might as well put it to good use. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the girl math, right? The girl math. I will destroy a tombstone pizza. Oh, those are so good. My family gave up already and did DoorDash Previa. <laughs> oh my goodness. I wish the loading menu would be quicker. Same. Same. <laughs> Lucinda, thank you so much for the super chat. Hey, Raven, what is your biggest ISO Valentine's Squishmallow this year? It's my first time hunting this year. Oh my goodness. I hope you have fun. I don't know. I haven't... I have not been keeping up, so... I, ha I haven't seen... I don't know the full picture, you know? I haven't seen all of them yet. I'm I'm behind on things. <laughs> I think there can be a thought bubble with Daisy Man. Your island, not sure, though. I think so. Yeah, I think it's only, like, when there's the events that they can't be there. Like the... Someone was saying the fishing tourney, bug catching tourney, KK. I think they don't show up on those days. I bet loading would be faster if we didn't all pack our islands with random items and custom designs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, probably. Alright, Isabel, thank you for your cherry bracelet story. You're the reason I'm going shopping for Valentine's decor this weekend because my house always looks like Valentine's. Let's go. It's the best way. It's the best way for your house to look, honestly. I hear one. Oh, oh, are we finally kicking the mans out? We're finally doing it. <sighs> Jeremiah, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What if this is the trick? What if this is the trick? I love him so much. He is my baby and my child and my little skater boy, but we're gonna let him go. We're gonna let him go. I'm so sorry, Jeremiah. Alrighty, peace out. Now we get to hunt. Make way for Lily, yes. <laughs> no, I'm so sorry. Listen, maybe this will help us. Let's let's channel our inner Delulu. Maybe this will help us find Lily. Finally. This is it. This is the time. This is the time. It's finally gonna happen. I've been doing all of this for a reason. And it's to find Lily on this hunt. It is. It is. <laughs> Sorry, Jeremiah, but you are not America's Next Top Model. <laughs> uh, a frog for a frog, exactly. A frog for a frog. If we don't find Lily, like... I don't know. By, like, spring, I will consider using an amiibo. Cause I'm not going a I'm not going on a year of looking for this girl. I'm I'm really not. Th that's too much. <laughs> Sashay away, Jeremiah. Oh, I hope we're not hunting in this. Well, he still needs to be in boxes, and then we time travel. But still, are we autofilling if we don't find Lily today? Um, I don't think I'll autofill today. I'll definitely hunt. I'll keep this open for next week, and then I'll see next week how I feel. You know, skate away. <laughs> I'm just, okay, listen, if you guys don't know the backstory on Lily, long story short, I wanted her from my very, very first island, hunted for her, did not find her, got her on Nookazon, okay? And I had her on Nookazon. Oh, it's Tangy's birthday. So I had her on Nookazon, or I got her from Nookazon, and that was the Lily that I, that I had. So I never was able to find her, like, on my own. Like, actually on my own. And I just have this thing stuck in my head now that I need to get her on my own. I need to accomplish this. This is a quest that I have assigned to myself. Nobody else cares about my quest, but I have, I have done this to myself, okay? It needs to be done. <laughs> I'm determined. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> Is it bad that I like Dobie? No, Dobie's cute. Lily might be a fever dream at this point. Everyone in the Animal Crossing community is collectively gaslighting me that Lily is an actual villager in this game and she actually doesn't exist and I've been hunting this whole time for nothing. <laughs> that could be happening also. 
Imagine another orange villager. If I get another orange one, I'm doing something. I don't know what it is, but it's going to be something drastic. Because I could, I could not handle that. I should have given Tangy a gift. She knows I love her. She knows I love her. Bestie Jeremiah was my love. I'm so sorry. I'm getting convinced that Lily and Goldie are not actually real. I feel like they're not. Every- <laughs> Yeah, they removed her. She's not in New Horizons. Ah, oh, dang it. <laughs> no. <laughs> Who was gonna tell me? What do you think of a space-themed island? That sounds so cute. That sounds so- like, cool. I don't think I could even do that. Give her bread. Hello? Miss Peach? I just- she just fell off the windowsill. Peachy. Come here. She's gonna pay tax. We keep having pepper stream tax. Now we need- a Miss Peachy stream tax. Guess what, Peachy? It's time to pay taxes. The stream tax. The stream tax. Peachy must pay the stream tax. She came into mommy's room, fell off the windowsill, and now she must pay the stream tax. The stream tax. You did so good. I know you don't like being held. You did so good. Good job. All right. She's much much worse than Pepper at being held. I'm very proud of her. Peachy stream tax. Wait, did it just say campsite? I was not. I was looking at the screen, but I was not comprehending anything. I think it was, right? Peachy is so cute. She's my little baby. She's my little baby. I was- Today? No, yesterday, I was eating lunch and I decided to make my lunch, um, like a little adult lunchable. So I did like crackers and lunch meat and like a cucumber slice on top with salt. And she loves to sit in my lap, especially if I, if I have a blanket on when I'm eating lunch. So she was sitting at my lunch as I'm eating these crackers and like I was, I was like dropping crumbs on her and I felt so bad like I was getting them off of her and trying not to make crumbs but she's just sitting there happy as can be with crumbs falling on her and I'm like oh my goodness Peach you truly are a precious baby. <laughs> Anyways let's see who's in our second campsite villager of this stream oh my goodness. Yeah, anyways. Yeah, anyways. Jade, thank you so much for the super chat. I'm late. How much longer is the stream and what did I miss? Also, what is the craving? So excited I caught the stream. Welcome, Jade. I'm so glad you could make it. Um, we finished off the decorating I was doing last week. So that was really it. And then we just got a thought bubble. So we are literally right now about to go on a villager hunt. Ugh, getting rid of Jeremiah really makes my villager tier list look so orange. Not tier list. Whatever. You know what I mean. Anyways. Oh, wait. I have no tickies. Hold on. Sally, be quiet. Honestly. I don't want to hear it from her. I don't want to hear it from any squirrel. No one in the campsite, right? Whoa. My tickies. My tickies. Give me my tickies. 10, 20, 30, 40. We have 50. We will probably not use all 50 today, but I own you know what? I could I could hear it from from my own, yeah. Why did I think Sally's name was Carol? I don't know why that's so funny to me. I've never seen an island resident list with so much vitamin C. Oh my goodness. Oh, <laughs> uh, let's pull up these tickets. Oh no, why is this font so terrible? Why is there no background? <laughs> uh, can I make this look better? 
Hold on, sorry. When I transferred over my computer, all of my, like, fonts got reset. Okay, whatever. At least that's a little more legible. I thought we did more than this. Yeah, no, we had more than this. I had to- I had to reset that. Or I had to reset it up. Hold on. Let me see what we landed on last time. Always, Alicia, thank you so much for the super chat. Now I want a Costco chicken bake. That sounds so good. That sounds so good. Uh, okay. We ended on 1,100. Yeah, yeah, because I, I had to reconfigure this, so... Um... I think I can just edit this file. Save. There we go. Okay. Sorry, I'm a chronic uh sitting on my foot person, so gotta constantly readjust because it falls asleep. <laughs> We're calling for Lily, yes. Lily vibes. Thank you for all the Lily vibes. Thank you, thank you. Oh, you know what I had this weekend? Bean, speaking of deep fried Oreos, I had a deep fried Pop Tart this weekend. It was. It was a lot soggier than I thought it was gonna be. It was okay. I wanted to get it to say that I had one, you know, like in my lifetime. But I think deep fried Oreos are, are more elite, you know? <laughs> Heavy Lily energy, yes. Yes. <laughs> Costco Caesar salad is actually amazing, super filling. I need to get a Costco membership just for the food. Oh no, you can you can go to the food court without a membership, right? I need to go to Costco soon. Alrighty. First ticket of this stream. I already saw who it is. It's a horse. That's that's a horse, yeah. Wow. Wow. It's it's a whatever first ticket. It's fine. Someday I need to go to a Costco, yes. Let's all go to Costco at the same time. <laughs> Let's all go to the same Costco. Rocky Crossing meetup at Costco. <laughs> was Monopoly Go your sponsor? The big one I was talking about last week? No. That one you guys won't see until like the summertime. It's gonna be a while for that one. <laughs> Big Transit Fabulous! Thank you so much for the four months! Hardcore Lily Vibes, thank you! Thank you so much! And Kat, thank you for the 15 months! Hey Froggy, lots of love from me! And Liho to you and PNP, thank you so much! I will relay the love! Thank you, thank you! <laughs> Let's do it! <laughs> Hydration check, we, need, we do need to hydrate! You guys can use my Costco membership. Oh, thank you, Amelia. We can all use Amelia's Costco membership. You can have up to like... How many people are in this stream? <laughs> um, you can have like 1,700 people on your Costco membership, right? That's fine. Right? Have you tried the chocolate cake at Costco? I probably have at some point because... Like, my mom used to have a Costco membership. Oh my goodness, it's Norma. She's so precious. But I haven't, I don't have one myself, so I haven't been there in a while. Shows up to Costco. I'm with Amelia. The next 1,699 people say, I'm also with Amelia. Oh, okay, yeah, that's fine. Okay, great, yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> that checks out, yeah. Make makes sense. Makes sense. Next will be Naomi. Maybe you'll find Lily at Costco. Ooh, she could be there. Do you, do you guys think that she's a Costco? Maybe she's that Costco in the long line to check out, and it's just been taking her like multiple months to get through it. Cause sometimes if you go like peak Costco lines are very long. People have like carts of stuff, and it's just long wait so maybe she's in the costco line you know getting her getting her family-sized pack of strawberries and, and chips and 
triple pack of meat? All the little empty sample cups in her cart? That's probably where she's been. Next. It's a bird. Bird is the word. Google says only two people on a membership. My heart is broken. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I think we can, I think we can maybe, um, you know, just sneak in a few extra. I think it's fine. Lily at Costco with 20 ice creams at the food court. She's too busy to make her appearance. Oh, now I want one of those, like, swirled ice creams. Oh, that sounds so good. Please, we all need to go to Costco. We're gonna get, like, 50 pizzas. And then we're gonna get ice creams, okay? We're all- we're gonna get, like, a thousand ice creams. Oh, Lily sets out a trail of samples out of Costco. <laughs> That's amazing. Have you encountered Raymond all this time? He's my birthday twin. I think so. I think so. Yeah, we can all just stuff into a trench coat. Yeah, obviously. I left for a second, came back at triple pack of meat. No contacts necessary, I'm, I'm not going to explain. And... Cherry, right? It's our Miss Girl. She's so cute. I, I do like her. Tra la la. Captain Underpants who? What? That's her catchphrase? Well, now I can never have her on an island because I'll just think of Captain Underpants every time. Do they have pepperoni pizza in Costco? Yeah. Oh, welcome, queen. Everyone in a trench coat. Why are you questioning my height? I'm canceling you. A <laughs> hundred... Wait, 1,111. I'm calling it. That would be a really satisfying number to get her on. I hope so. <laughs> yeah, Froggy, let's totally sneak in 1,699 extra people into Costco. They're not gonna notice. They're not gonna notice. What is Costco? Costco is a... Okay, so it's like... Is it wholesale that they call it? It's a store where you go and buy like groceries and stuff, okay? But you have to pay for a membership to get in there and shop, right? It's kind of a crazy concept when you think about it. Um, and then you go in there to shop and they have everything but like omega size. They have like, like instead of like one little pound of strawberry like the regular container that you get they'll have like one that's like three pounds it's supposed to be where you go to buy stuff like in bulk but wholesale bulk warehouse store but you have to pay but a lot of people say that like oh you save enough money buying in bulk that the membership is worth it and then they also have a food court with great food and they have samples for you to try of like the food and stuff that's pretty much what it is but they have a hot dog that is so good. Oh, now I want the Costco hot dog. Should I just go get Costco for dinner instead of cooking my food? Costco key lime pie. Wait, do they have key lime pie? Oh, but like that you can buy. Okay, I was thinking of a food court. But yeah, obviously they have key lime pie in the frozen section or whatever. The bakery. <laughs> yes. Yes, do it. Don't- you, you- you're not supposed to support me! You're supposed to say no, Raven, be responsible and cook your food. <laughs> Costco hack, put a Costco hot dog without the bun into a chicken bake? Okay. Interesting. In Canada, they have poutine in Costco. I really want to try poutine. Sounds so good. You can buy the hot dogs in packs of 14 to take home? Well, for my Froggy Crossing meetup that I'm gonna do, maybe one day, I'm just gonna get Costco hot dogs in packs of 14. 
Sounds great. Sounds like a fun time. And then I'll juice them into water. Oh, I, I genuinely thought this was a frog. It's just a hamster. Go buy chops in the Costco food court. Mm. I think um, he is not legal to sell as food, so I don't think they sell him. <laughs> that's that's the that's immediate food poisoning. Never pass health inspection. Raven, I can DoorDash you hot dogs. Thank you. Actually, I meant no, Raven. Be responsible and cook your food. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. I will have to do that. I want Costco hot dog and pizza and ice cream. One day. One day. And the footlong churro. <laughs> Lemon pound cake, thank you for the super chat. <laughs> Go get Costco, no. <laughs> Well, now I have to. Legally, now I have to go. You're in control of my car. And send me to Costco. Vlog a day of only eating Costco? That'd actually be fun. Ugh. Ew. It's not chops, that's what I'll say. That's what I always say. At least that one is not chops, but still. Still. Chopped is chops is not FDA approved, exactly. I know! They discontinued the churro! We were just talking about that earlier. The churro was a staple. They needed to keep, like, a long f food on their menu. Hot dog. Churro. That's it. But, you know, I can't believe they betrayed us for a cookie. It better be the, the best cookie I've ever had in my life. Otherwise... I don't know what I'm doing. I'm buying all the hot dogs they have and turning them into hot dog water and putting it in the public water system so you turn on your sink and it's hot dog water take a shower in hot dog water that's my threat to costco hope they're listening do we have sam's club in florida yeah there's sam's club costco bj's warehouse I think that's it, right? <laughs> Free hot dog water. Oh goodness. Oops. It's that bunny. I don't remember his name, but it's a bunny. Don't give me the mental image of you manually juicing a hot dog. <laughs> I would not do it manually. That's way too much work. And we would have hundreds of hot dogs to juice. I would have to get a hot dog juicer, you know? They they definitely sell those, right? For one million, make hot dog water soup. Ugh. Ugh. Hold up, did you just say take a shower hot dog water? Yeah. What about it? What about it? We're almost there to the very satisfying number. We're almost there. <laughs> I've seen five minute crafts where they drill a hole through a hot dog as a straw. Have we gone too far as a species? Piper, thank you so much for the one month. I can't believe it's been a month since your gift stream. Thanks again for the gift, Raven. Oh my goodness, yes, of course. I'm glad you've been enjoying it. Thank you for joining us. Hornsby, cutie. <laughs> Am I ready for 900k? No. I don't know what I'm doing for a million yet. I know it's, it's gonna come this year, I think. Which is so, so amazing. So I'm trying to think of something really good for a million. And getting to 900k means I'm closer to a million, which means I still don't know what I'm doing. What games have you been playing other than Animal Crossing lately? 
Fortnite, Lethal Company, um, Mario Party and Jackbox when friends come over. That's pretty much it. We usually do Fortnite and like a different game that like people are into at the moment, like whatever the the hottest game is or whatever. Doing all hot dogs crafts? Oh my goodness. A million is crazy. We're just at 250k, right? I don't know what happens. I don't know what's been happening. Baking? Yeah. We gotta, we gotta do something baking-wise. I need something, like, very challenging, but at the same time, I don't have the skills to, like, do that stuff, you know? <laughs> I love me some Fortnite. Same. Alright, this is... Yeah, this is... 110. It's a penguin. I should crochet a Costco hot dog. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely, definitely. The best celebration would be Lily. If she's not gonna come until I hit a million, then... I don't know what to say about that. Face reveal was a month ago. I refuse to believe the time is real. <laughs> Honestly, like, it's... It's gonna be so long now, like what, two years? Three? I have to look. I have to look. When was this? April 10th, 2021. Time since April 10th, 2021. <laughs> 1,017 days. 1,017 days. In. Years. <laughs> 2.7 years. Okay, almost three years. Listen, that's how bad at math I am, okay? Almost three years. Ram Crossing, thank you so much for the 15 months! I opened up Animal Crossing last night after not playing for six months and I ran on my island for five minutes and then shut off my game! I'm so sorry. I feel you. I feel you. Oh my goodness. You know, I've been trying to think of like a video to make to like help people like that exact situation you're talking about. Like how can I guide people to like actually do something on their island instead of just logging off, you know? It's been 84 years. No way that was 2.5 years ago. Been something. It's been something. Time is an illusion. All right, this is the one thousand one hundred and eleventh ticket. Let's see if Miss Lily is here for us today. It's Tipper. <laughs> uh, sure, sure, I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> Bye, Tips. Oh yeah, this is my biggest Nook Mile ticket hunt, Shadow. It is. It is. Tipper is leaving Lily a tip. Here's a tip. Show up. Please. I'm so sad that she wasn't on the satisfying number. I'm so sad. Raven, what does your drywall taste like? You know, I think it's got kind of like a, a subtle flavor. It's got a subtle flavor of dust. And, um... There's a hint of cat fur in there. Um, cat fur essence. I think that's what it, that's what it tastes like. Thanks for asking. I have build ideas for my island, I just can't bring myself to actually do them. Yeah. Yeah. 30 day challenges when I found you since then I've been trying to catch up on old videos pretty much have. Aw, thank you, Kayla. I'm so glad. I'm so, so glad. Subtle sneeze. Bless you. Yo, that's crazy. My drywall tastes like green beans. Hmm. I'm not a green bean fan, so I, w I wouldn't eat your drywall. Sorry, no offense. <laughs> Oh, 
All right, please. No. Chicken. Chicken. Well, you kicked out Jeremiah. No, he has the preppy house. I'm sorry. He was the fir first one with the thought bubble, so he had to go. If all your islands were a flavor, what would they be? I love this question. Okay. My first island was a fairy core island, Pelican Bay. That one would definitely taste like strawberries. I'm just thinking like fairy, very like pretty sparkly vibes. It would taste like strawberries, okay? Strawberries and cream specifically. Kid core would taste like one of those like swirl. Sorry. My second island was a kid core island. Um, leapfrog. That one would taste like one of those swirly rainbow lollipops that you get. That you like lick it and it's like, well, this is way too much sugar. That's what it would taste like. <laughs> Bread tag flavor. Um, okay, what's the next island after that? Sorry, no. Was Storybrook or that 30 day island? Um, we'll just go 30 day island. My 30 day island lack was a little spring core island. So I'm thinking spring. I'm thinking Easter. I'm thinking marshmallows. Marshmallows. Then we have Storybrook, which is a farm core island. That's gonna taste like um a freshly picked carrot, but with a little bit of dirt on it. But it's it's like still good, you know, it's like good dirt. It's good dirt. And what else? We also have we have my other 30-day island, which was a forest core island. That one's gonna taste like a nice homemade soup, like a nutty soup, maybe some potatoes in there, some like delicious, delicious things in there. It's like a nice solid soup. And what's the last one? This one. Uh, my tropical Florida core island, I think legally has to taste like an orange, otherwise I do get arrested. <laughs> That's what they should all taste like. Leapfrog should taste like bubblegum. Bubblegum would also be a good one. That would also be a good one. I just really love, uh, like, the rainbow lollipops, you know? Leapfrog was so colorful. I feel like it has to have rainbow. Gotta love the good dirt, yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Fairy core is giving peach meringue. Ooh, that's a good one. Kid core is one of those giant lollipops, yes. Current island tastes like orange sorbet. That would be good, actually. Or key lime pie for Florida, right? Lack should taste like lemonade? Ooh. Wait, two people said lack should taste like lemonade. I think it's a sign. <laughs> Allison, thank you so much for the super chat. Your bits help get me through postpartum. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad. I'm so glad that they do. I am here for your entertainment, for your anything. Laughs, whether you're laughing at me or with me. I'm glad to be here for you. <laughs> thank you for joining us, Allison. I appreciate it. Lemonade lack. <laughs> How are those strawberry Hershey's, Hershey's Kisses, by the way, and the marshmallows? The strawberry Hershey's Kisses are pretty good. Like them. Been munching on those. Um, the, the marshmallows I haven't tried yet because it's one of those things where this food is too cute. I can't eat it yet until I have a special occasion. So I'm waiting. Oh yeah, the Halloween Island. I totally forgot about the Halloween Island. Um, I feel like that has to be candy also, right? The Halloween Island is gonna taste like every Halloween candy mixed together. <laughs> the other 38 island was barren. <laughs> definitely, definitely, uh... Did you guys see Sophia Nygaard's video of, of uh, mixing every Halloween candy together? <laughs> Welcome to Froggy Crossing's channel. We suffer together and say really weird stuff. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Girls gather around. I've got some nice dirt on Storybrooke. Ooh, spilled the tea. No, I didn't say it tastes like tea. I said it tastes like good dirt. Exactly. It's that good dirt. Hello? Hello? Where are they? Please. Hold on, they're just hiding in that little corner. I just know it. 
Oh, oh, okay. It's th that was Lopez, right? <laughs> Definitely has to be like Sophia Nygaard's video. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> Exactly. Action Frog, thank you so much for the eight months. <laughs> Opinions on the Squish Boycott. I'm still collecting, but mostly from Mercari. Anyway, lol, my mom is getting a surgery soon, so that's good. Love as always. Well, I'm, I'm so glad to hear that about your mom. Again, I hope everything is going all right. I'm sending you the best, best of vibes. Uh, yeah, same. I'm kind of just collecting secondhand right now, so... That's kind of where we're at. Very, very unfortunate, but... Yeah, if I, if I see one juicy on Mercari, I might get one. And Bella, thank you so much for the super chat. So, girl, I recently got into Gel X nails and I need to put you on. If done right, they're so strong and last a good amount of time. I've been seeing so much Gel X on my TikTok. I feel so intimidated by it. I do just like regular gel right now, but the Gel X looks so good. And I feel like I could better, like, paint them also. This is my sign. Thank you. Bella, this is my sign. This is my sign. <laughs> I'm gonna- I'm gonna look into them. What made you choose YouTube over all other platforms? Um, that's just where I was seeing a lot of Animal Crossing people post stuff already. Like, I was watching Animal Crossing YouTubers before I made my channel, so... That's where... I already saw people doing it, so I was like, okay, let me just do that then. I've always been a big YouTube watcher, YouTube video watcher. Oh my goodness, again. Okay. Okay. Anyways. My mom is dying to have Costco in our city because we don't have one and I'm gonna die to try another slice of Costco pizza, yes. Where would you get a Jellex kit that's good? I'm not sure, maybe Amazon? I'm gonna look on all the TikToks that I see. <laughs> they always have a they always have one linked with like the one that they used, so I'm gonna check those. I'm gonna go watch I'm gonna go do research, aka watch TikToks. <laughs> Beatles has the best gel glue. That's what I use for my regular gel nail polish. So I actually would get something from Beatles. I I do like that brand. I've heard that they are pretty good. Yeah. Lily is not in bloom, apparently. <laughs> yeah, because the only thing with the gel nail polish that I do is um, I just have to use 100% acetone to remove it, and I just feel like I'm always impatient to take it off, so hopefully those soak-off things that I got at the dollar store will help. Um, cause then other than that, if I don't soak them off, then I'm like peeling them or scraping them and then I feel like it will sometimes damage my beds, my nail beds a little bit. But also cause I get impatient, so I just need to be more patient. I just soak and look at Antonio and then leave. I've never tried gel nails or acrylic. I like them both. Acrylic nails, I I have gotten before, maybe once or twice. Um, but it's one of those things where I feel like then I have to go back to the salon to get them removed. And sometimes I just don't want to commit. You know? I just don't want to commit. So I've been doing them myself. I've got, well, this, hold on, my thumb came off the other day, but... I tried to do like a pink gradient, so we've got the darkest pink on my thumb, and then it goes lighter pink all the way to white on my pinky. Just kind of a pink look. Wait, this is a better way to show it. <laughs> so, I did those. And then I think when it gets closer to Valentine's Day, I'm gonna try to do a uh, more like pink and red look, and then I have like some little hearts. I don't know what they're called. They're not stickers, but they're like the little little things that you put on your nails. I'm gonna try to use those. Where do you get the nail polish? I use the Beatles gel nail polish on Amazon. Just because regular nail polish I feel like does not work that well for me. I'm always doing stuff with my hands. 
to like make the nail polish come off. So I need like strong stuff that works a while. It's Elmer. Peach is playing under the door. As a former nail tech, I will say acrylic is harder to do without proper training, but a lot of the poly gel and gel -like stuff that's been coming out seems more DIY, DIY friendly and worth it. I will definitely keep that in mind. Yeah, the gel likes looks really, it looks really fun. It looks fun. <laughs> Elmer looks like Bojack Horseman, but that's just me. Oh my goodness. Wait, you just reminded me. Has anybody, has anybody seen... This person on TikTok who got these really cheap eyeball rings off of, like, Shein or something. <laughs> and she's been doing, like, her entire account now has been her doing, like, these random videos with, like, the hand as, like, a person. Oh my goodness, there's so many more since I last checked. But she did one of Bojack. That's why I got reminded. eyelashes on them <laughs> I'm sorry they're so funny <laughs> they're so funny it is so stupid it's so great it's so great <laughs> oh my goodness what is her username her her username is secret sof society sorry Secret society, like sofa as in Sophie. <laughs> it's so good. It's so good. And like, I didn't play the audio, but like in most of the audios, she's just cracking up. Like, <laughs> like they're just absolutely cracking up at them, at like herself doing it. It's so good. It's so good. I'm concerned for your mental health. So. It's fine. Anytime I get sad, I'm just gonna look at this. Oh, she did Marge. She did Marge from The Simpsons. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> I'm gonna pee myself. <laughs> There was a TV show like that. Yes, Ubi. I watched Ubi. It was so good. I think that's why I really like it. Because it reminds me of that show. <laughs> Sorry for the distraction. Okay, we've got Tank. Goodbye. This will add to Lily Luck, Shirley, yeah. Shirley? I'm fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Don't pee like you did in third grade. You're gonna you're gonna bring up my third grade pee story. Sometimes I tell these stories and I like to think that nobody ever rem remembers them. And then people just bring them up and I'm like, who told you that? Who told you that? <laughs> Were you in my third grade class with me? <laughs> Action Frog, thank you for the super chat. Make Quacky yell Lily vibes. She will come. Listen, if I can get this man to do it, we shall see. We shall see. Load, please. I'll send him a, a very important top secret message. I can't type today. <laughs> Egos. That's the first thing I saw when I tabs back into chat. The request has been submitted. The request has been submitted. 
What breed are your cats? Just short hair cats. At least you didn't throw up your first day of kindergarten like I did. Oh no, I'm sorry. I've watched Jenna Marbles turn herself into a chair, do a mouth. Uh, I can never know how to say it. Is it mukbang or mukbang? Mukbang, right? I can't judge, lol. Well. <laughs> Miss Jenna. <laughs> Come on, Quack, we believe in you. To this day, I think that her mukbang, but it's just my mouth video is the most hilarious thing on this internet. It's so good. It's so good. Who even- I don't want these bears. I don't want them. I was a crier? Oh no. I understand. In first grade, I also- also would cry. I would not want to leave my mom at all. He asked from my room, question mark, and then put a separate question mark. Oh? Hello? Lily vibes. That wasn't a yell. Lily. You're Now you're whispering. Lily vibes. Okay, thank you. We'll take it. We'll take it. Thank you, sir. No problem. Pepper's in here now. He yelled it one more time. I don't know if you heard it. Woo, we got it. We got it. <laughs> A very gentle yell. Very gentle Lily Vibes yell. We did it, guys. We did it. <laughs> oh, I'll tell him you guys said thanks. <laughs> Alright, this next one's Lily. Who did that voice? I don't know, some random man that's in my house. <laughs> I know, Raven texted her man like, bro, you gotta do this for my chat. <laughs> I will read you the message I said. I said, my chat is requesting that you yell Lily vibes for good luck. That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> He's a, he's a great sport. He's a great sport. Cat. Lily's lost at Bucky's. I'm telling you, someone come get her. <laughs> I love when you told him to yell, he whispered. For real. Pepper. Hi. Meh. Anybody else's cat just go meh. <laughs> Lucky Bamboo and Quack, and yet still no Lily. For real, though. Live-in boyfriends really do be strangers in your house. Mine, too. <laughs> Hi, Pepper. Meow. Pepper, you have to pay taxes. I am so sorry. You're stomping all over my desk. You, you think you're gonna stomp all over here and not pay tax? He's putting- Hello? He's putting his paw on my arm. You see this little paw on my arm? <laughs> Alright, Pepper. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Please, sir. 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 He doesn't- He's- He's evading taxes! <laughs> he does really not want to be held right now. It's very close to his dinner time. So he's very on edge. Um, he kind of paid half a tax. Ha half of one. Oh, now this is just... This is just sick. This is just sick and twisted. Okay. Sorry, Pepper. I feel bad. <laughs> the tax evasion. Yeah. It's... Sad, he has to live a life of crime, you know? I thought I raised him better. To not steal, commit tax evasion, lick whipped cream and cheese. Florida cat evades taxes. <laughs> I do remember the McChicken incident. What other incidents do you guys remember from from my stories? Let's see let's see how many we can we can rattle off here. 
I just realized we've gone over two hours, which I usually stream for two hours, but you know what? We're gonna keep going. <laughs> Did Quack just curse the stream, honestly? Did he just have the opposite effect? Silly bands, okay. Squishville scandal, scandal, yes. Cake powder incident. Ego from Stranger Things, okay. Mm hmm. Pepper eating the cheese. Well, the bread tag. Yeah, obviously. Obviously. Don't worry, Raven. I don't remember anything. Thank you. The hot water story. Which hot water story? Pepper and Peach getting into the catnip. The stale long crouton from your 23rd birthday. I don't even remember half of these. <laughs> Where was the stale long crouton? You guys are remembering my life better than me. <laughs> Eating the teacher's pretzels. Okay, yes. It's Blanche. Wasp in the bathroom. Oh, that one's iconic. Uniform incident. Peeing your pants. Yeah. Hot dog drink. Gorgeous, gorgeous girls eat Hello Kitty ramen. Oh my goodness. I was just watching that vlog the other day, actually. The big spider in the living room. Frozen sauce nugget. <laughs> what was long stale crouton? I don't remember. Crying because you didn't have your glasses, yes. Mm -hmm. The mar the burnt marshmallow casserole, yep. The froggy boba, yep. <laughs> Me being born. Crouton club in middle school, yep. I'm a kung clean the spider thing was made up. I'm, I'm pretty sure I've had a spider in my living room before. <laughs> pepper being pepper. Cece's pizza croutons, yes. <laughs> Raven, I'm filming you, Quack. Why? It's not like I film videos for a job or anything. This man again! This man again! Anyways, the frog smoothie conspiracy, yeah. What was the long crouton? I need to know. Imagine you get chops. Let's not. Let's not, actually. All of the baking videos. I'm, I'm so glad all the baking videos. Are uh, iconic. Stealing candy from the teacher. Oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, I gotta double check the tickets after this. Time for takeoff. Was it from Cece's Pizza? I need to go find that picture. What? Oh yes, I vaguely remember. Yes, I went to Cece's for my 23rd birthday. And there was the long squishmallow. Or sorry, not the squish. The the long crouton, my goodness. Kayla, thank you so much for the four- or the- sorry, the six months. Can't read. I was wondering if you would ever do your plushie again. I see it in your room in all your videos and it's so cute. I would love to. I really would. The company that I worked with for that, unfortunately their method is just that short little window and then never again. So even if I really, really wanted to, I couldn't. But hopefully I will do more plushies in the future and they will be even better. And you can get those. Oh, Squishmallow. It's because I was reading Squishmallow from Rip Van Winkle. Thank you for the super chat. Asking if I still have the Squishmallow blanket. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. It's it's in my office. It's on the, it's on the very bottom of my shelf. Okay. Tickets. These are miscounted very, very much. Okay, wait, we started with 1,100. We have 19. It should be... Wait, because we have 26. 50 minus 26 is... Something. I don't know how to do simple math. 50 minus 26. 30, 24, definitely knew that. Um, okay, so it should be, yes, 24. 
Don't perceive me and my lack of math skills, okay? Okay. Let's do one more to end <laughs> on an even 25 and then I'm gonna get going. Let's go eat my dinner. Go eat my dinner. Unfortunately, not from Costco, maybe. Maybe. We'll see. For our final ticket, our final ticket, I will absorb all of your Lily vibes if you would be so kind to give them to me. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, Star, thank you so much for the super chat. Pepper, no stream taxation without cat, <laughs> cat presentation. <laughs> <laughs> amazing amazing and rip and winkle thank you for the super chat tax evasion cat is wild T tell me about it and i'm the per i'm the adult responsible for him crystal thank you so much for the super chat my seven-year-old daughter elise loves your streams you're the only streamer she watches actually shout out oh my goodness shout out to elise for watching me and only me only me Thank you so much, Elise. I appreciate that so much. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Oh my goodness, why is our last ticket a bird? Sadness. Sadness. <laughs> Today was kind of cursed. Today, this, this hood? Multiple duplicates. Naomi. What's the other pig that's almost chops? The other pig? That was, that was very unfortunate. <laughs> And Rip Van Winkle, thank you for the super chat and the lily vibes. Very sad. Very sad. Well, at least we got a lot done today. We finished off our build. We hunted by Action Frog. We made progress. And that's something to be proud of. It's something to be very proud of. I will go do a quick walk around our build for those of you who didn't see it. If you just joined later... We finished our little lookout area. I'm so obsessed with it, honestly. Ignore the rest of this island, it's a disaster. Here's the lookout island, sorry, lookout area. <laughs> so cute. It came out so good. I'm obsessed. And then you go up, you go up there and, and you look at it. Isn't it great? <laughs> you deprived of us, oh my goodness, can't talk. Deprived us of water, I know. I know. I thought if I did, maybe Lily would show up. I don't know. Didn't work. <laughs> we will go ahead and do one final hydration check because I feel like I did actually deprive everyone of water. So let's end off with a hydration check for the road, besties. Um, if you miss SARS earlier, then we grab our beverage and we drink when it hits 30 seconds. It's so, so simple. Stares at snow globe in desperation. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, good night, Emma. Uh, yeah, whenever you guys are ready, if you want to drink some water with me to end off our day together, let's go ahead. Take a sip. Great job, everybody. Great job. And, um, we'll go ahead and you know what? You know what? Double feature. We'll go ahead and do goose time while I say my goodbyes. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for spending this quality time with me today. <laughs> and recounting all of my incidents in my life. I appreciate it. We'll be back next Monday for our stream, continuing this hunt. We are ducks. And uh, yeah, I'll have some more videos and stuff this week as always so thank you so much i'm gonna go cook my dinner um stay safe stay hydrated and i'll see you later bye